I'm Amy Taylor and this is Pamela Thomas and she is a certified physician's assistant at Hess Orthopedic Center and Sports Medicine and we're talking about with the warmer weather getting back into the yard work and the garden I'm not really interested in the yard work but I do like to get into the garden protecting our backs what is your formula for doing that I tell people to think of the three initials BLT like the sandwich mm -hmm. Bending, lifting, and twisting. Those are the things that if you combine them is usually going to give you some kind of an injury. You don't want to bend and lift at the same time or twist and lift. Okay, So that's, that's, that's when you want to be careful. And then what about protecting your knees? What would you say there? Usually when you're lifting, it's better to lift with your knees to protect your back, but if your knees aren't that strong, then I would recommend that you get like a kneeling pad or maybe the pads that go on your knees mm -hmm. to do work that's going to keep you down for a long period of time. Okay, and the most important thing you can do before you even head out the door to go to the yard or the garden, what should you do? Hydrate. Okay. A lot of people forget to hydrate and then they get out there and get fatigued and then they're more prone to injury. Okay, and then um, what are some of the common side effects and injuries that occur while people are working in their gardens? What is the most common thing that you see? The most common thing for all the doctors is to see lumbar strains. Okay. And this is going to probably happen to a lot of people and I tell people if you're starting to feel it while you're working, you need to take a break. Take a break and go rest, drink some water, maybe put some ice on it and consider an anti-inflammatory. Okay, and if you have a concern about your back or your knees or anything like that, you can definitely give Hess Orthopedic Center um, a call and Pamela would love to help you there. You can also get more information at whsv.com backslash moms every day.